I'll see you in Vegas. <laughs>
Well, good morning and rise and shine, Pool Player Nation. Welcome here to the Renaissance Hotel in St. Louis, Missouri, where we have coverage of this year's junior championships. I'm your host, Jason Bowman, joined by the one and only Florian Venom Kohler, the birthday boy. Yeah, I guess Happy so. Happy birthday, buddy. <laughs> Thanks for being here. And folks, we've got an exciting day ahead of us. We have four junior championship matches to be decided here at the Renaissance today. Uh, should be a great match in our juniors event. This morning we have in the green tier from Anna, Illinois, we have Anthony Wiseman. He is a skill level two. His opponent comes all the way from Innisville, Ontario, Canada, Megan Meisner. She is also a skill level two flooring, which means race to 19. Yep, that should be fun. Uh, I think, yeah, Megan's been playing for a little more years, like eight years, something like that. EPA for a while, and... Uh I think uh, Anthony, 44 years or something like that, right? Yeah, and I know you had the chance last night to interact with the kids a little bit. You did I your did. exhibition, yep. and yep. Uh, so I know that was exciting, but obviously the, the real excitement here now in the finals to see who walks away with the, the championship title. Yeah, I talked to both of them briefly. They're pretty nervous, so we shall see. <laughs> All right. I'd be nervous too, actually. So we'll settle into the day again. Four matches. I think the players are anxious to get started here in this fantastic arena we've assembled here at the Renaissance, and we are about ready to go. Tournament director has signaled the players. Anthony won the lag. Anthony Wiseman, he will have the break. Florian, I feel like we're kind of like in Vegas. It's like we transplanted Pool Vegas. Dog Arena here. but uh, The arena is beautiful. That uh, Pool Dog Arena is beautiful again. We are what here a, at the work. Renaissance. Yeah. Anthony with Big the break. break. Again, each ball is worth one point. The nine ball is worth two points in APA nine ball. Dry break for Anthony, and we'll get our first look at Megan Meisner. As Florian mentioned, Megan's been playing since she was seven years old, so yeah, she's got eight um, years of experience we under her We were talking belt. about it yesterday. I think she actually was in the first junior show I did uh, out there in uh, was it Iowa. Back right? in da yeah. Davenport days. Yeah. yeah, that's a while back. So Megan very briefly at the table, pushes the one down towards yeah, the rail. She didn't have much of a shot, so let's see what Anthony gets. Tough cuts. Doable, but you know, again, you got to keep in mind those are skill level twos, so and very nervous. Talked to both of these kids before the match, they were, as you mentioned, nervous, not a whole lot to mm. say. <laughs> Granted, they're 15 <laughs> and it's early in the morning for a 15 <laughs> year old. I'm surprised we got all these <laughs> folks here in the arena today, but yeah, we actually quite a few people watching already, so it should be packed later today. If you're just picking all up right, the feed. First point here, I think. Let's see. There you go. And one nice ball drops. Run. Ooh, this this is a little bit dangerous here. Now keep in mind, you know, it is nine ball, so any ball you don't really have a good shot at it. Sometimes you just kick hard at it. Something good happens. Oh, oh. nothing good there. Nope. She scratches in that side pocket. Do we have That'll give Anthony ball in hand here. Do we have access to the score at this one? I one oh nothing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Perfect. Right there. All right. Fancy monitor, know, your little this drawing this monitor. Florian's going to draw some pictures and <laughs> as we go. <laughs> this has become a lot fancier than it uh, used to be. I know you're more used to being in front of the camera than kind of in the Actually am. behind yeah. the scenes. But uh, Florian, again, here to do the exhibition last night. Talked him into hanging out to do the commentary today. We're excited to have you. It's been amazing to see the growth of that uh, streaming. Yeah, it's been amazing to see the growth of that uh, the arena. It started with very little stream, I remember. And then uh, now it's basically TV quality. It's amazing. Yeah. It's amazing. All right, Anthony Wiseman back at the table. Yep. Anthony is again, right? Yeah, he's got ball in hand. It's not too bad. He's going to probably make the two. The problem is the three ball, as you can see. Oh, let me see if I can. Yeah, you see the three ball here. It's completely taken, so there's not a lot to go. You can try to go in the middle of the table somewhere here, but this is... You know, pretty pretty dangerous. It's not a good shot if he goes back down table either. So let's see if he goes towards the middle. Yeah, that's what he did. Oh, he missed it. Can both these players yeah. skill level twos? This is our green tier. These are our lowest skill yes. level players. They are still developing their skill set. So not uncommon to see them miss a ball here and there. No, for sure. and quite frankly, the shot two to three was very difficult anyway. So but she's gonna have the same thing. Megan takes advantage, though. Pocket uh, set, too. Yeah. I think she's going to have to kick at it one rail. Again, I would just kick it pretty hard. Yeah. Nice. Nicely done. And she's going to get a save out of it, I think. 
the ability is completely snookered, so he's gonna have to go. Let's see if he goes one rail here this way. This is most likely what he's gonna have to do. Uh, I don't know if you can see under the seven on the other side, but I don't think it's a good shot. So, you know, such a short race here too to, yeah, to 19 every race. ball. So yeah, important. It could, could go this way as well, but this is a bad shot. Yeah, it's gotta go up much better. Again, try to keep it at its pace. So something may happen at this level. A little bit of left spin would help. It's close. You get it? The way back. Got it. He got it. I don't know if that's the way he meant to get there, mm. but he got there nonetheless. <laughs> I do not believe so, but he did, he did <laughs> hit it pretty well at the right pace. See what I mean? When you hit it at the right pace, it, you know, good stuff can happen. So, Granted, he did leave her shots, but... All right, so this is looking a little better now with the three out of the way. Oh. I don't know if this one is going to go. Let's see if we can get the top view to see if that three ball goes anywhere. I don't believe it goes. It'll be a very tough cut on the left side. Mm. Yeah, this is this is tricky. So it's, mm, this is too hard. I mean, in my opinion, the right shot is here, but it's too difficult. So... I wouldn't even play there. I would pretty play safe. Put the three ball somewhere in the stack here. They were kind of hooked. But let's see if he goes try to cut it. Could be a combo as well. Okay. Well, I think this was a combo attempt. Can't really tell. Uh, I don't know if she sees the three full face. If she sees the three full face, easy safety. Stop shot on the three and keep the cue ball behind the five nine. That's what she tried. There we go. That's enough. Nicely done, actually. Again, an APA nine ball. Each ball worth one point. That nine ball, however, worth two. And this is a race to nineteen, so things can move pretty quickly. Yeah, actually, ball here, ball there, and suddenly you're on the hill. Yeah, the nine ball is worth a lot at this level, so. Just gonna kick at it again, one rail to the long rail. Let's see. Oh, we've got two rails again. Not hard enough this time. So it's gonna be a ball in hand, no rail after impact on the three ball. One of the weird rules in pool, I guess. Yeah. Like you said there, made contact, legal mm -hmm. contact with a three, but did not drive a ball to a rail after contact, which is the key there. So it's a ball in hand situation for Megan. A chance to take a three nothing lead here, Florian. Yep. I think she's going to take this one. She's going to have a good shot for the four after. And the five is not too bad as well. So, well, perfect. Fires that three in the side yep. pocket. There's a little draw as well. She can do the same thing here. She'll be golden for the five. Megan wanted to say hi to her mom and her sister back in Ontario. Ooh, it wasn't going that easy. Yeah. Her dad, Craig, here in the audience with her. Yeah, I know Craig's very well. You know, Craig was one of the first uh, league operator to book a show for me, I believe, in, the <laughs> in Canada nice. a while back. Like, almost 10 years ago, probably. Anthony Wiseman now returns to the table. Yeah, he's got to make a point here. He's been pretty nervous so far, but he doesn't, you know, he doesn't really have a good shot. And it's nine ball sometimes. It just doesn't leave you anything great. And he's got to put up with it, really. Yeah, the bank is very difficult because the six is on the way and then the five's on the way. The cut is very difficult as well. It might be a good safety shot here if we could just nudge the four, drive the four into the short rail and then keep the cue ball the other way. But again, it's key level two, so yeah, dangerous, dangerous this way. I think this is the third ball in hand is going to give Megan here. Another opportunity to pick yeah. up a key point in this race to 19. She's definitely going to make this one again question is, how is she going to make the five ball? Well, what an experience for these young players, though, Florian, 15 years old, to be here in an arena like this with a yeah, championship on the line. Pretty cool experience, for sure, for these amazing. kids. Amazing. I mean, I wish we had stuff like that when I was a kid. <laughs> There's a you lot know? of things these days I wish I had when I was a kid. <sighs> Man, I was, I'm envious, you know. I keep seeing this, <laughs> and I see this arena. I mean, I don't remember playing that until, you know, ESPN days almost. See if Megan can get her fourth point here with the four ball. No problem. Yeah, the shape was a little tricky here. She needed to draw the cue ball, uh, but this is a dangerous crotch here. So let's see if she can avoid the scratch. 
Avoids the scratch. Oh, here we go. Hold on. There's a see the five nine combo here. Uh, this may be a little advanced, but there's a carom up to five into the nine that could result in good stuff. And we get an overhead look at that. There we go. Yeah. So if I go this way here and then send the nine ball this way. Let's see if Anthony sees what you and see, Florian. If he doesn't make that, he might have a chance to make the four down table as well. So I think he sees it. He did see it. See, both balls went the right direction, just uh, didn't capitalize on it. Good shot. Good knowledge here. Bank shot here again for Megan, I think. Cut is doable, but don't uh, like it very much. Yeah, it's going to bank down table. Oh, Ooh. nice. Gets okay. a little lucky there in the side pocket. I didn't see this one. She will <laughs> take that. Five <laughs> ball Mini drops. Yep. Great shape on the six, actually. Picks up her fifth point. Look at that. Here we go again. Oh, no. never mind. Just at the last minute. Oh, can you see that? Hard to say if you can see the six ball fully. Yeah, Anthony's had some tough looks he's as he comes to the terrible, table each time. Terrible yeah. shots every time at the table. But that's nine ball for you. The problem with short races is sometimes luck doesn't turn fast enough for you. So, but um, you know, could be a completely different rock to second rock. So he's got a rail first. If he cannot see it first, uh, ball first, I think he might be able to. But he could rail first into the long rail most likely if he can't see the six right away. Was seeing it enough. The problem is to leave. Yep. Okay, he's gonna leave another pretty <coughs> doable <coughs> shot for Megan here. Again, the shape on the seven is going to be a little tricky. Talk about how nervous the kids are here, Florian. I can only mm. imagine how nervous the parents are sitting here watching <laughs> their children. <laughs> As a parent myself, yep. I can only imagine. Megan. I believe they're opposite side of the room. All right, Ooh, Megan on the roll one. here. Nicely done. Two balls yeah. in a row, two more points. I'll tell you what, maybe we'll take a 10-0 lead right there. She now leads 7 nothing. Well, the 8 is not there yet, but it is uh, it is manageable, and uh, the cue ball should come back nicely for the 9 if she plays just below center here. This is that 8 in the corner. Yeah, she played it nice, just missed the 8. So, All right, Anthony, you got to pick up those 3 points here. Finally, he's got a half a decent shot at the table, I think, for the first time. Bit of a cut there on the eight ball, but he seems to know what to do here with it. See if he can execute the shot. Yeah, the question is where his cue ball is going to go right after two. That it's not so easy to leave it down there. Nicely done there for Anthony. Pockets that eight in the corner. He's yeah. on the board, but not necessarily Again, the Again, tough luck here because you know, he almost hit it dead perfect. Would have went behind the nine, would have had a perfect easy shot. It's not impossible, uh, obviously, in the corner. But you got to be careful here. If you're just joining us, you're watching the green tier. That is your skill levels one and two and nine ball of the APA Junior Championships which got underway on Thursday here in St. Louis, Missouri, the Renaissance Hotel. Nicely, Nicely done. done by Anthony. And a big, a big, deal. big pick up big on deal. those three yeah. points, Florian, because like you said, look like Megan might pick up all ten there. But uh, we get a 7-3 split after the first rack. We're going to hear a quick word from our friends at pooldog.com.
continuing coverage of the APA Junior Championships. Big shout out to our friends at PoolDog.com. Big supporters of not only the APA, but Florian as yeah. well. Florian and actually Kohler. did a new commercial. It looks awesome. Yeah, fantastic Just got a job by first Kevin look and the crew. It. Yeah. Yep. Love the work they do there. For all of your billiard accessories, cues, gloves, whatever it is, PoolDog.com's got it. They have it. Yep. Appreciate their support in helping us bring you this outstanding coverage. Anthony there with the break. Tough luck, though, as he scratches. Yeah, a chance to pick up some points. Had a great break, and uh, the Bulls kind of moved the right direction, but just no luck where he ended up here. Tough morning here for him so far, but it might change, you know. That's not for you guys. Megan back at the table here. Megan Meisner, again, she is from Ontario, Canada, currently leading this match 7-3 to three in this race to 19. And where's the two ball? Oh, this is tricky. So as you can see, the two ball is down there. So she's going to have to make quite an effort here to draw that ball. Yeah, she tried it, but no luck. It's a very difficult shot for a skill level two, honestly. Uh, yeah, she's... Uh, I don't know if she can see a If she can see a piece, she might be okay. There we go. Right, Megan now leading eight to three after making that one ball. Anthony Wiseman back to the table here again. Both of these players, fifteen years old, both skill level twos. Fifteen years old, man. <laughs> Brings back memory. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what, he's got a good chance here at either playing a good save or even playing a two nine combo. Depends what he's fancying here. I like it. He went for the offensive 2-9 combo. To be fair, you know, the the shot was difficult anyway and uh, could have, you know, could have worked, so and 2 points for the 9 ball is a big deal, so. And he left uh Megan not the best of the leave again. Let's see if his luck can turns a little bit here. A couple of tall 15-year-olds here too, huh, Florian? These kids yeah. are I had a kid yesterday. I think he was uh, trying to take a picture. I'm looking at him. 6'3". Oh. Got Look it. That she got, got it. it. Oh, I mean she that seven she ball. hooked herself big time by the four ball. Wow. Um, yeah, unfortunately, there's no timeout here. This is where, the, let's say, you know, timeouts make a massive, massive difference. But, uh, well, she's going to have to uh, make a miracle here. All right, so she's got a couple options. Could be one here, but it's real bad. Don't like it. Then, yeah, she's got this here, but I think it's too close to the four. Yeah, and there was the two rail that I was going to draw that she tried, but it was very difficult as well. I'm going to give ball in hand to yeah. Anthony. All right, now the question is, Anthony, can you make the three anywhere? Or does he have to do the three-nine combo? So you ideally you try to make the three here or there, but I don't think he goes. So that would leave him a long shot here with ball in hand, which as a skill level two you don't like. So I think he's gonna go for the is he gonna go for or maybe maybe he goes by. Hard to say from where I'm standing. If he goes by the nine, he should be okay. Okay, he did. Perfect. All right. The fourth point on the board there now for Anthony, who trails nine to four. Long shot. Big tester here. Gotta hit that like a three quarter half a ball type style hit. Let's let the ball go. Close. Uh it wasn't a bad shot. Again, I think you see you know the nerves of mm -hmm. playing here in the arena with the audience and the high stakes here in the championship. And as I understand it, the kids are playing for a Nintendo Switch, a prize package that what includes a Nintendo <laughs> Switch. <laughs> that's a big so deal. Yeah. As a boy of 15 years that's, old. That's what I hear. My eight-year-old is already lobbying for one for <laughs> her birthday, so I don't even know what that is. But You know what I was going to say? I don't <laughs> think I'm aware either, really. I just know Nintendo. And I haven't right. done much in my life since playing pool, basically, so <laughs> that took over quite a lot. So All right, big tester here again in the corner. Let's see if he can make it. Nope. 
kind of worried. We don't know if they can hear us or not. So, oh, we ended up with a perfect safe, actually. I tell you what, luck has been turning a little bit already. See what I mean? It's nine balls. Sometimes you, you know, you get stuff. Sometimes you don't. And uh, he's been leaving Megan a lot of tougher shot than the first rack. Yeah, kind of a role reversal there, mm -hmm. where she was leaving Anthony with some very difficult shots. I'm just gonna go one rail on the top rail here. Well, nice hit. Again, I like it. It's hit kind of hard, so stuff can happen. But she did leave him an open ball. So should mention that there is no coaching allowed. This mm -hmm. is individual competition, which means. These kids are on their own to navigate the, the rack as best they can. Mm, missed it again. A lot of trouble with that four ball. Yeah, yeah. But again, doesn't leave a whole lot for Megan. Doesn't show a lot of emotion, though. Kind of the same... Same face, so both of them actually. They haven't really changed much. Oh, I don't even know it. She's gonna try to bank it, I believe, in the side, but be careful with the cue ball. Oh, she went for the safe. Mm, okay. All right, so this should be okay. Question is, can he play shape to get the cue ball back to the bottom of the table where the five is? pretty straight, so he's going to have to get a long shot, most likely. Anthony finally able to pocket yeah. that troublesome four ball, picks right. up his fifth point of the match. Left himself long, very, very difficult shot here. Whew, yeah, I think you might as well just bank it. But again, be careful with the cue ball. Kind of trucks towards the corner naturally if you go for the bank. If you go for the cut, it should be doable, just a tough shot. Well, he went for the bank. Got the ball, but he scratched, which means we've got a dead ball, folks. That ball will, or point, I should say, will come off the table. No point awarded. It means there will only be nine points available in this rack. Yeah, unfortunately, with uh, you know being a skill level two, sometimes you see the shots and you see the problems and the scratch, but you can't necessarily, you don't necessarily have a way to avoid it, right? And that's usually uh, what it comes into. And you know, he made a great bang, but cue ball uh, didn't go anywhere good. That's not a ball in hand for Canada. <laughs> Another point there for. Oh, she Megan. drilled that one. Drilled that one, no question asked. Tough shot on the eight, though. All right, tough cut, doable, but and the bank, unfortunately, I think he's taken here. Go for the cue ball. Oh, and she's gonna leave him. Pretty rough shot again. Eleven five, huh? She's getting there. All right, this is a big shot here. See the leave. Okay, could have been better. It could have been worse. Megan now with 11 points, just eight away. Three still on the table in this second rack. Yeah. So after talking uh, Megan yesterday, I believe she said she went almost all the way from the loser side. Oh, really? On this one. Yeah, she lost one of the first or second game. And then uh, actually went back all the way, so I'm not sure about Anthony. This is a modified single elimination tournament, which means you're guaranteed to play at least twice, yep. not necessarily lose to twice. lose twice. It kind of depends on how early you lose. And like Florian said, Megan sounds like she lost one of really her first early. couple yeah. rounds and was able to pick things up from there. So Anthony Wiseman back at the table. Very difficult shot. Two rail or three rails, depending what he picks. Long rail, short rail, eight ball, or long, short, long, eight. Let's see how it gets close to it. Two rounds. Nice. Nicely done. Nice. Oh, not much luck. of a reward no, for it, but zero luck here. Nice job him. by Anthony to get a clean hit on the eight ball. 
Megan with a chance to pocket it in the corner now. I was going to say, be careful with that one. I saw the, saw the follow on that. This is second dead ball of the rug, I believe. Yep. That will go down as another dead ball, which means only eight points available in this rack after Megan pockets the eight but runs the cue ball right in behind it. Ball in hand for him here for two big points. Yeah. So Anthony's got to be thrilled with this opportunity. Absolutely. Yeah, get real close to it. Two points. Big two points. Big swing there, I huge, feel like, Florian. Huge, yeah. Um, Anthony now pulls within just four points after the Yeah, very scratch. unexpected because uh, he got very unlucky when he made the contact on the eight. Left Megan an easy two balls out, and she uh, unfortunately scratched on the eight. So. A nice look here at the arena renaissance. If you've not done so yet, you're going to want to make sure you subscribe to all of our social media channels, including our YouTube and TikTok. The new TikTok You've channel. You've been TikToking a lot? <laughs> not really. No? I should be doing it You're a lot more. You're always on the forefront of the social media. Uh, You're not To be TikTok honest with you, uh, TikToking, I kind of missed the, bud, uh, <laughs> the whole boat here. Facebook page, which is yeah. where we're coming to you guys at. Hello, Andrea Salas, one of our reigning champions from last year's World Championships in Vegas. Anthony with the break here. Big break. All right, here we go. Ooh, that's two balls two at least. Two balls on the break. And a shot on the one. Pulls within two points here. Things are getting interesting. Very interesting, yeah. Yeah, we thought Megan was basically going to get away with it in the second rack, and we got a match. Some folks asking about YouTube. We are not live on YouTube this year. Hmm. Interesting. Some internet yeah. issues. We will upload the matches to okay. YouTube after the fact, as well as our Roku and Amazon Fire apps. Oh, be careful! Oh. <laughs> just, just as we thought things were, <sighs> I was a great inching shot closer. Too. Yeah, played it uh, real well. Played the right, you know, the right spin on the cue ball to get shape on the two, but you just can't get a break today. Just gonna have ball in hand once more. Let's see how she gets shape for the three. done. Good little draw here to get shape for the three. It's going to be played a three in the corner here. And as you can see, the five ball is uh, really brutal, so she's just going to try to make the three, I believe. Oh, oh misses that it. three in the corner. Oh. All right, so this... Look at this shot here. It could go here. So if he makes the three in the side, his chances is going to hit the nine on the way, too. So I think it's a good shot to take. And if he misses the three, he's still going to probably move the nine anyway. So. Okay, went on the other side of the nine, but... And that'll put Anthony at ten points now, yeah. trailing by two. I don't know what he's going to do with his five roll, though. Combo maybe five eight. Sounds like it, if he's not playing safe. Oh, nicely done. A nice shot Tough there. luck again, yeah. Tell you, I like his vision. He plays the right way. You can see just like a little bit of the execution, but he sees the team real well already. That will be a great player. 100%. Not sure who's been teaching him, but you can see some knowledge right there. Hmm. Well, she was fortunate to get to the rail with that cue ball. Yeah. Avoids the ball in hand situation, but does leave Anthony with a pretty open shot on the five in the corner. And as you can see, the seven is uh, right near the pocket, too. So if he makes this, he'll most likely get the seven next. He did, oh, I just talked too early. <laughs> he gets the five in the corner. That puts him I at think 11 he's points. actually snookered with that. Behind the eight. I don't know. It may be okay. You should be able to see it. Nine ball. Bring 
brings Megan back mm -hmm. to the table, clinging now to a one-point lead in this race to 19. And look at who's got the tough shot now. Good try. Good try. A long shot here for Anthony. A little fake, but we've seen him bank before, and he seems to bank pretty well. There is no scratch really on this one. Kind of a natural shape on the A2 if he does uh, bank the 7 in the corner. So focus on making it. Could cut it as well, can he? Yeah, could cut it if he wants it as well. Overcut it. Yeah, huh? it's a good try. Good try to try to cut it. Uh, a little too much spin, probably. All right, Megan's got a shot here on the seven. It's not an easy shot, but all you got to really focus on is trying to make the seven natural shape for the eight nine combo after. Here seven go. drops. Watch Be out. Careful. Cue ball careful. runs down hard. table and yeah. also falls. Another dead ball here. Mm, she just hit a little too hard. So no point there for Megan. She will stay at twelve. Anthony trails by one, but. Looks to be in good shape here, maybe. Should be taking advantage here, I believe. Uh, this is a familiar theme of this match, Anthony, mm -hmm. at the end of the rack, with yeah. an opportunity to pick up points, and he gets two there. Gets the lead for Florian the first takes time. His, yeah, takes his first lead, 13 to 12. And he will once again have the break. Again, if you're just tuning in, you're seeing coverage of the APA Junior Championships. This is the green tier. The first of four championship matches to be decided today. We'll have coverage going throughout the day. Our next match is set to kick off at about 10.30 a.m. Central Time, 11.30 for those of you on the East Coast. We have 256 kids here this year. That's 29 states, two countries. You see the breakdown of the tiers. Our biggest tier you're seeing this morning, 112 yeah. kids in the green tier. Wow. It's amazing, yeah. I'm actually impressed that we already have 30 black tier kids yeah. as well. And we will see them. I believe we're going to go right down the skill mm -hmm. levels today. So we'll, our next match will be the, uh, I guess, the threes and fours. All right, so we've seen Anthony break before. He's got a big, big break already. If he can try to keep this cue ball on there. He's now six points away. Yeah. This could be it's it. Not this rack. Look at the cue ball, actually. Gets the two. All right, he made a ball. He's got a shot on the one. And he escaped the scratch on the cue ball. Looking good for him. Now five points away from victory. Make sure we thank all of our sponsors. Of course, we mentioned Pool Dog, but Aramith, Billiard Balls as well. You can see they're playing on the Aramith TV balls here in the championship match. So Anthony pockets done. that one. All right, I don't know about the three ball, but oh, it does go. Got to be careful with the scratch here. Got to hit it thin enough that you avoid the scratch. This is the three in the side. Three, yep. All right, Megan needs to make something happen here, Florian. No, I think she's not out. She's not. Uh, it's not out of the question yet. Now trailing by three points. Nice shot job there to get Beautiful that three shot. ball. Oh, I don't know. I wish I could see it. Can we see the top, the overhead camera maybe? We might be able to see. Oh, this is tricky. Oh, nice. she hit that beautifully. Big shot there. No question asked. Real first, nailed it. Look at that. Pockets Perfect shape four. for the five. <laughs> Pulls within one point here. Yeah, we got a great match actually right away in the morning like this. Beautiful. Fires that five ball in. <laughs> Florian, we're tied at 15 oh, points, but she's. This is tough. She left herself hugged up on that nine ball yeah. pretty good there. What is the score right now? It's got to be even. 15 huh? 15, yeah. four points. Okay, she's got to play safe oh here. Oh, no, no, no. Good hit or bad hit? That bad ball hits. does not get to a rail, so big yeah, opportunity she, now. She was dead, dead, dead on this nine ball. Very difficult shots. Anthony with a big opportunity. Ball in hand needs four points. Tell you what, the kids have picked up the pace. You can tell the stress level kind of probably level, you know, got. Got out of the belt a little bit, and there he can 
six, seven, eight. It's not too bad. Give that play a little draw here if you can. Nicely done. Beautiful. Nice sleeve. Okay. He's got the same thing here. He can play a little draw, leave himself tough. We can play follow and get back to the eight. No, not enough draw, so this is going to be tough. Could bank it, I believe, though. So Anthony two points away. Fired it. He's Maybe not one row. The eight ball. Hold on a second. Ooh. Tough lead. I'd say if the eight went in the easy spot, that would have been a whole different ball game, but Megan needs to make something happen here. We haven't seen a lot of safety play, have we, Florian? No, this is tough to save anything here, though. I said, oh, she can hope for it. She doesn't leave him a good shot, but that's not looking like it's the case. So he only needs two points, really. There's three left on the table. Needs this nine ball to go, and he will be your new champion in the green tier. Here we go, folks. Hold your breath. Anthony Wiseman shooting on the nine ball for the victory. Oh, Florian, this is that <sighs> drama, nine. drama, Oof. drama. Okay, she can make that. New life for that. Megan. And she's at what, 15? So they would put it to 17 and... Got to have this nine ball. Got to have this nine ball in the it. break. Absolutely. Wow. She did not shake at all. <laughs> Whew. Buddy, on the brink of elimination, she pockets that nine ball. Trails by one point. No she matter. has the break here, folks. If you were hoping for excitement to start <laughs> your day, hopefully you've been watching from the beginning because we've got it here at the Renaissance. Tell you what, no matter the skill level, the excitement is always the same when you have close Outstanding matches. Outstanding right? first yeah. match. Outstanding. So exciting. Okay, so she needs two balls. He needs one. <sighs> break is going to be massive here. If she can get a ball and a break, there'll be a tie. This will be the first break we've seen from her. She had lost correct, the lag, actually. and then Anthony yeah. had picked up the nine ball in each of the last three racks. So. To be quite fair, he had a great break. So We'll see what Megan's got here. Yeah. Two balls on the Breaking break would the win center. it. About a nine on a break, maybe. Yeah. Oh, the nine didn't move. Do you want something in? Oh no! But <sighs> look at where the one is. I was gonna say, I, I was gonna say no because she's gonna leave him to it. But she did not. She actually dry break and no shot on the one. Wow! I don't think he can do anything with that. Test, test. Okay. All he can do is, well, if he wants to go offensive and try to make the, whoops, hold on a second is this way, but it's a very tricky shot that's to win the game. And if you just try to get good hit, it's gonna have to be this way, which is gonna be easy. Guaranteed the one could fire this way as well, so not impossible either way. The problem with this shot here that he's looking at right now is the sevens on the way. So and this shot not a fan of it. I mean this, this shot here well. could decide the match. It could. I mean it could be the best shot of his life really right there. Getting to that one may mean the difference here. He's got to hit the one at least if he doesn't make it, though. Oh, yeah, that's what I was worried about. That's a big shot because he was close to the rail. Now he's going to give ball in hand. She's not out of the woods, though, huh? Because ball in hand, hard to say. The two ball is an easy shot. It is not an easy shot on the two. Again, she oh needs she's not the two right more shots. points here. Okay, well, she's going this way. She's going to have to go all the way back here towards here. Pockets the one, but again, yeah, not course, a great yeah. leave on the two. Yeah, unfortunately, that would have been a perfect coaching situation again. She is snookered on the two, isn't she? Mm -mm -mm. All right, two rails here. Two rails, long rail, short rail. Must get to that two, oh, and she doesn't do it. No. So Florian, this is going to be bowling. This hand. is going to be ball in hand with one point needed for Anthony here. I mean, big breath here. What a way, what a match. Anthony oh. Wiseman shooting on the two ball for the victory. Big breath here. Two there ball falls, folks. Anthony Wiseman 
Anna, Illinois. He is our junior champion in the green tier with a nail-biting wow. final there. We'll see if we can get a quick word in with our newest champion, Anthony Wiseman. We've got our junior reporter here, Harper Bowman, here to talk to uh, Anthony a little bit. All right, let's let's uh, let's get a word from our junior reporter, Harper Bowman. Hey guys, Harper Bowman here with the junior champion, Anthony. Congratulations. How does it feel to have won the championship? <laughs> have you ever won anything like this before? No, I haven't. What do you think your friends and family are going to say about your big win? I think they'll be pretty happy for me. What advice do you like to give give kids are s that are starting out playing pool? Just keep at it. Anyone back at home you would like to give a shout out to? Um, what's up, Nick? <laughs> How <are> you? <laughs> Congratulations again. Back to you, Jason. <laughs> oh, that was the cutest thing ever. Nice job there That's by our brilliant. our junior reporter Harper Bowman. And our champion, Anthony Wiseman. Anthony is a man of few words, is he not, Florian? <laughs> that was wanted to brilliant. give a shout-out to Nick. Whoever Nick is, what's up, Nick? <laughs> All right, folks, just getting the day started here at the Junior Championship. An outstanding what start to the day in the green wow. tier again. Congratulations to Anthony. Congratulations to Megan Meisner as well out of Ontario. Fantastic start to the day. Florian, we're going to be coming back in about 25 Sounds minutes, great. folks. Come back and join us here on the APA Facebook page. Thanks for tuning in.